Sam, the IDF is releasing a new interactive map today that has divided Gaza into hundreds of numbered evacuation zones. They say that it will be used in the next stage of war. Any word on the purpose of these zones and how they may be used in this so-called next phase? That's right. So the Israel's military is advancing its offensive to the south of Gaza, and it has released this map that has what it calls evacuation routes, where people are supposed to be able to go to be safe. The United States had made it very clear to Israel that during the second phase of the offensive, it needed to be more strategic, more precise, and more targeted in its attacks because it's been accused of indiscriminately killing people during its attacks in the north of Gaza. But these maps have come out. People say that they are complicated, they're hard to read. Also, they came out online. It's unclear if everyone has access to them if everyone has access to the internet. I spoke to some people in the south of Gaza today who said that the bombing is is indiscriminate. It's just happening all over the place. One man sent me an audio message while he was having dinner so I could hear what he was listening to. The audio message had his children singing a song to the backdrop of drones and planes. He said that he tries to keep them occupied by singing with them and playing games so they can be distracted from these constant explosions. Thank you for watching. Go to newsnationnow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.